Hello YouTube, this is We All Juggle Knives. I've got a new machete. Yes, it's a Latin style machete. Uh, Amazon sells this as the Buckshot Survival Machete. This was sent to me by the company that owns Buckshot. Now on the off chance that you actually want to use this machete for uh, what machetes are often used for, clearing soft vegetation, as you can see, it is up to the challenge. Now I did sharpen this, but the sharpening was not necessary for this. It's necessary for, uh, well, we all know the real purpose of a machete is to cut bottles, so that will be later in the video. But it did a, it did a real number on this vegetation. So yeah, if you have to trim the hedges around the yard, this thing would be perfect. And don't worry about this particular piece of vegetation. It grows extremely fast. I have to trim it several times a year. This machete did awesome at just normal yard work. Now there you see the blade itself. It's 15 inches by my measure. It is stainless steel, but that's good if you live in an area where there's a lot of humidity, moisture, precipitation. I did wrap the handle just because my uh, butcher's gloves are slightly slippery, right? But y you won't need to wrap the handle. I also added a lanyard. I don't know who this guy is, but frankly, he gives me the creeps. I don't know. He looks a little bit weird, but I wasn't going to say no. He wanted to be in the video. Looks like a psychopath to me. I wouldn't trust this guy. Uh, some of you who follow my channel, you might know who this is. All right, I'll stop kidding around. That is uh, myself. We all juggle knives. And I just wanted you to see the machete in hand. You know, 15 inches for a machete. It's a good intermediate length. Not too long, not too short, not too hot, not too cold. Here's the sheath. Now the sheath is pretty much the minimum possible thing that you could still call a sheath, right? It's got a Velcro retaining strap, and you saw the belt loop there. I mean, it's a machete, you know? I mean, it's not, an, it's not a super collectible, expensive knife. There is the edge. Now I did sharpen this with a work sharp. It came pretty sharp. You really wouldn't have to sharpen it, but I'm going to be doing a demo with this where I do some static cuts on bottles, and if you've ever tried that, you know that uh, if your blade isn't sharp, the bottle is just going to go flying like you hit a home run. Oh, you saw I also put a lanyard on this as well. Here is a nice flyby of the Buckshot Machete. Now let's talk price, or not talk price, because the company that sent this to me, uh, they are a wholesaler, meaning they sell this to stores, and then those stores charge whatever they want for it. So if you see this around and if you think the price is too high, you know, that's not the fault of the wholesale company. Uh, I will email them and ask them where the best place to get this is. Okay, and we'll see what they say, right? But it's my job to demo it and to review it. You know, critiques of this would all be around the stainless steel, right? But for this use, you know, it's going to bend rather than break because it's semi-flexible. I just say that because people are afraid stainless steel, long blade, is it going to break? It's going to bend rather than break. However, if you were to hit this into really hard wood, which is not the use of a thin Latin machete, but if you were to try to use it as a hatchet, you could chip the edge. But for soft vegetation, it's perfect. Okay, people, so that about does it for the review, and the remainder of this video is going to be some fun footage of me demonstrating the edge I put on this uh, with my work sharp. Going to be cutting some containers. The music you are going to hear is Amazing Grace with bagpipes. Love bagpipes, reminds me of Braveheart, shout out to Scotland. And I did put a black and white filter on this footage, which allows you to see the action better despite the glare of the sun. And yes, the containers are refilled and recycled. Please stop asking if they're recycled. They are. Okay, I hope you enjoyed the video and enjoy this footage. This has been We All Juggle Knives.